reception. Lovely to see you again for another maths lesson. We've got a new number to learn today, but first, let's warm up our brains. Today for warming up our brains, we're going to count from one all the way to 10, and from 10 all the way back to one. Then we're gonna do a little bit of one more and one less, because it's been a little while since we've learned that. Let's count from one to 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now let's count back from ten. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Now I'm going to say a number and you're going to tell me what is one more than that number. What is one more than four? That's right, one more than four is five. What is one more than two? Good job, one more than two is three. What is one more than five? That's right, one more than five is six. Now we're going to do one less. So remember, for one less, the number gets smaller. We go backwards. One less than five is? Good job. One less than five is four. One less than two is? Well done. One less than two is one. One less than six is? That's it. One less than six is five. The number gets smaller. It is time for counting or for looking at the dice, but remember we don't count, we just try to say the number. Please start. Six. One. job. Two. Oh, four again. Two. Well done. And last one. We've got four again. Fantastic everybody. Good job. Now, today we have a new number. It's a number that is one more than six. It's the number seven. So first, let's clap seven times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and stop. No more than seven, just seven. Let's nod seven times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and stop. No more than seven, just seven. Let's jump seven times. One, Two, three, four, five, six, seven, and stop. No more than seven, just seven. We'll do one more. Let's shake our hips seven times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and stop. Well done, fantastic. I'm going to show you how we write the number seven. We start at the top for this one and we go across the sky, down from heaven. That's the way we make a seven. Watch me, I'm going to write it next to it. We'll start at the top. Across the sky, down from heaven. That's the way we make a seven. Can you get your magic pen? Your magic pen is your finger. We're going to practice writing the number seven in the air first. So get your magic pen, take off the lid. Start at the top. Across the sky, down from heaven. That's the way we make a seven. Practice it one more time. Start at the top. Across the sky, down from heaven. That's the way we make a seven. Well done, everybody. We're going to practice writing the number seven after this video. 
We've just practiced in the air, so you should be good at it. Now, I would like you to have a look at these pictures, and I would like you to pause the video and tell an adult, what can you see in on the screen? What can you see on the pictures? Pause the video, tell an adult. That's right, I can see seven sweets. I can see, ooh, seven spots on the dice. The, the dice has landed on seven spots. Six on this dice and one on this dice. That makes seven altogether. This is the, num the Numicon piece number seven, and I know that because it's got seven holes in it. I can see seven spots on the ladybird, and I can see seven fingers. Show me seven fingers, five on this hand and two on this hand. You can think of another way to make seven on your hands. Pause the video, make seven fingers. It doesn't have to be this way, but it can be another way. Have a think, pause the video and have a go. Good, now we'll count our seven fingers. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven fingers. It is time to start to find some more objects around your house. Underneath, there's a number hidden under the circle. I would like you to go and find that many objects. So, first, I would like you to find seven Pause the video, find seven books. Careful counting, please. Off you go. Make sure you do careful counting. Count your books. Fantastic. Next, the next number I want you to find, oh well, I want you to go and find some teddies or toys. Teddies or toys. I would like you to find, oh, have a look, it's the number seven again. I would like you to find seven teddies or seven toys. Pause the video and find me seven teddies or seven toys. Good, I hope you did careful counting. When you find seven teddies or seven toys, I wonder what the next number is going to be. Let's find out. Ooh, I bet you thought that I was going to show you the number seven again, but that is not the number seven. That's number six. We've learnt number six. So can you find me six hangers from a wardrobe, please? Six hangers for a wardrobe. Pause the video. Good, I hope I didn't trick you. Did you definitely get six this time? Not seven. Good, last number I'm going to show is the number seven, our number of the day. Can you get me seven shoes, please? Careful counting, pause the video. Fantastic, everybody. Seven shoes. I hope you did careful counting. Right. What we are going to, what I would like you to do now is, on your piece of paper at home or a whiteboard if you've got one, I would like you to practice writing the number seven. I'm going to show you again. Across the sky, down from heaven, that's the way we make a seven. Can you see I try to write on the line as well? Even though it's maths, we can still practice writing on the line. Across the sky, down from heaven, that's the way we make a seven. I would like you to practice writing the number seven, seven times. After that, I want you to practice all the numbers that we've learned so far. So far. Number one, number two, three, four, five, six and seven. If you know more numbers than that, please
please keep going. That would be good too. So that's what I would like you to do now. Have a wonderful day. Good luck with writing your numbers and I'll see you again tomorrow. Goodbye.